We're looking at Pythagoras' theorem. Pythagoras was a Greek mathematician who discovered that if you have a right angle triangle, and it has to be a triangle with a right angle, the side opposite the right angle, which is called the hypotenuse, has a relationship with the other two sides. The relationship he found was h squared is equal to a squared plus b squared. So for example, if we had a right angle triangle where a was 3 centimetres and b was 4 centimetres, we could find out what h is. We just use the formula h squared equals a squared plus b squared. So that's 3 squared plus 4 squared. Now 3 squared is 3 times 3, which is 9. 4 squared is 4 times 4, which is 16. So h squared is equal to 9 plus 16. 9 plus 16 is 25. So we've managed to find that h squared is equal to 25, but of course we want to know what h itself is. h squared is 25, so what is h? Well, h will be the square root of 25, and the square root of 25 is 5, because 5 squared is 25. 5 times 5 is 25, so the square root of 25 is 5. Now, if you want to, you could do all that on the calculator. So let's first of all turn it on. And what did we say? We said that one of the short sides was 3 centimetres. So if we type in 3 and then square that, plus 4 squared, and then press equals, it's going to show us 25. 3 squared plus 4 squared is 25. And to find the square root of 25, we just need to find the square root key, which is this one here. Square root equals, and it gives us the answer 5. Sometimes, of course, the question is going to be much more complicated or have much larger numbers. So, for example, I've got a sketch here of a triangle where one of the short sides is 3.6 centimetres, the other one is 5.2 centimetres, and we want to find the length of the hypotenuse. So, again, we use Pythagoras. h squared equals a squared plus b squared. And again, it's a good idea to use a calculator on this one. So, we're looking at 3.6, so into the calculator we type 3.6 squared with the squared button, plus 5.2, so 5.2 squared equals, oh and that works out exactly at 40. But the square root of that is what we need now, so square root equals 6.32455532. So because we've gone to one decimal place in the question, we'll go to one decimal place on here. So that will round to 6.3. So the hypotenuse of that triangle is 6.3 centimetres.